Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Meryl Streep. left in us, don't we? What does it take to be the first female anything? It takes grit and it takes grace. Deborah Sampson was the first woman to take a bullet for our country. She served disguised as a man in George Washington's Continental Army. And she fought to defend a document that didn't fully defend her. All men are created equal, it read. No mention of women. And when she took a a blast in battle to her leg. She was afraid to reveal her secret. So she took out a penknife, she dug out the musket ball, and she sewed herself back up again. That's grit. And Grace? Hillary Clinton has taken some fire over 40 years of her fight for families and children. How does she do it? That's what I want to know. Where does she get her grit and her grace? Where do any of our female firsts, our path breakers, where do they find that strength? Sandra Day O'Connor, Rosa Parks, Amelia Earhart, Harriet Tubman, Sally Ride, Shirley Chisholm, Madeleine Albright, Geraldine Ferraro, Eleanor Roosevelt. These women share something in common. Capacity of mind, fullness of heart, and a burning passion for their cause. They have forged new paths so that others can follow them, men and women. Generation on generation. That's Hillary. That's America. And tonight, more than 200 years after Deborah Sampson fought, and nearly 100 years after women got the vote, you people have made history. Yeah. And you're going to make history again in November. Because Hillary Clinton will be our first woman president. And she will be a great president. And she will be the first in a long line of women and men who serve with grit and grace. She'll be the first, but she won't be the last. Yeah.